What's up everybody? I am back with another cash stuffing video. It is Christmas Eve when I am filming this, so Merry Christmas to everyone that celebrates. Um, I hope everyone has a great holiday, but for now, let's go ahead and get into the stuffing. As usual, we are starting off with my dog, whose name is Candy. She's going to be getting $20 this week. I've been trying to add more to hers at a time. Um, that way, if something happens, we are good to go. 20, 40, 60, 70, 75 in Miss Candy. She's standing right next to me. I was, I gave her a piece of turkey <laughs> a few minutes ago. So now she's just sitting on the floor wondering why I'm not giving her more. <laughs> Car maintenance is going to be getting $10. <clears throat> So now we have 100, 200, 220, 230, 240, 245. Clothing is going to be getting 30. I was doing some online window shopping the other day and I just found some really cute clothes that I actually wanted to buy. So I told myself I was going to start beefing this up so I could get some more winter clothes because I've been wearing the same outfits like every week. So um, so now we have 20, 30, 40, 50. And I went ahead and put those clothes that I was looking at into my cart online, but I didn't buy them yet. And the total came out to $80. So... Um, once I get $80 in here, I will go ahead and place that order. Gifts is getting 30 as well. My sister said she wanted workout clothes for her birthday in January, so that is what I'm saving up for. So now we have 50 in gifts. Um, the reason that seems like it hasn't <laughs> increased any is because I was at my sister's house last weekend when she was showing me these new mirrors that she got, it, but she couldn't get it out of the package. So I was trying to get it out of the package for her and I broke the mirror. Don't ask, I don't know. So I gave her $20 so she'd get a new mirror since I broke that one. And I guess I'm gonna have seven years of bad luck now. So that's cool. Groceries, food is gonna get $10. I did 10 because honestly, I have plenty of food here that I need to eat. I don't need to go buy more when I haven't even eaten the food that I already have. And it's the holidays, so, you know, my mom's going to be cooking and all of that. So, I just put 10 in there because I need to get some milk. And I think that's it. I just need to get milk. <laughs> Home is going to be getting 20. 20. 20. 20. I'm from Texas, y'all. So now we have 20, 40, 60, 70. I got some patio furniture. Well, my stepmom sent it to me. She lives in Fort Worth, and that's what she got me for Christmas. So I have patio furniture now, but I want to get some, like, fake plants to go out there and maybe some, like, string lights. So I'm looking forward to saving enough for that in my home category. Spending is going to be getting 20. I meant to give myself two tens, but I didn't, so. I wanna mention real quick that I had been saving my dollar bills as much as I could in a, a jar, like my change jar, but it was for dollar bills. And I was doing that, but the other day I was out Christmas shopping when I saw a man on the side of the road and I wanted to give him some money. But then I realized I usually take money for that out of my gifts envelope, but I didn't have any smaller bills in here. So it was fine. I gave him $10, but I wanted to be able to have smaller bills. That way I'm, I'm not just giving like, you know, $10 bills out at a time because I don't have the money for that. Um, so I took the 
dollars that were in my dollar jar out of there and put them in here. So I have a bunch of just $1 bills right here. And I'm going to start keeping those right here in my wallet. That way, if I come across somebody who is in need, I can just reach in here instead of the dollars being at home because that's not helpful. I was saving those to buy myself something, but I really don't. I mean, I have plenty of other categories to purchase things from. So my dollars are forgiving now and I'm going to keep them in here. In here, I have some change. I don't know. I do not know why, but getting the change out of here and putting it in my change jar is so satisfying for me. <laughs> don't know why. Oops, that's the wrong. There we go. Now when I get changed, I'm like happy about it. I'm like, yes, give me change. Perfect. That is it for that wallet. Next up is my little clear binder here. I hope this angle is better, by the way. Let me know what you guys think. I had a comment last week saying that it felt like everything was kind of far away, and I completely agree. I feel like I got it a little bit better this week. If it is better, let me know. If not, I can see if I can get it closer, but I feel like this is really good because you can see over here, you can see over here but I'm not like way far down, if that makes sense. So if you like this, let me know. That way I can keep it this way or I can switch it up, switch it up if I need to. Next up is Car Note, which will be getting $50. This one gets kind of stuck. I don't know why. It might be because this, oh, I'm not sure. Anyway, see, I don't know why it's doing that, but. 50 in car note. So now we have 100, 200, 300, 400, 450, 470, 490, 500. I have 500? Oh my gosh. That is so exciting. Yay! 500. Whoop, whoop, 500. All right. Christmas is getting nothing until the beginning of January. I had a comment saying that the way I have Christmas written um, takes Christ out of Christmas and I completely understand where you're coming from. But the reason I have it like that is because my stickers were so big. I learned from my car maintenance envelope that I was gonna have to use smaller words. So I couldn't fit C-H-R-I-S-T-M-A-S on this envelope. So that's why it says Christmas. So if that's offensive to you, I'm really sorry, but I'll be getting new envelopes eventually, but I just got these. So, I mean, this is just what I could do. So we're just gonna be having to look at Xmas here for a little bit. Hair is not getting anything, but as you can see, I only have $10 left in hair because I was finally able to get my hair done last night. I was so happy. I look like a new person. <laughs> Travel is getting 50 because I'm saving up to go to Florida, which I'm so excited for. Now we have 50, 70, 95 in travel. And like I said in my last video, we are going to Florida February 4th or 5th, whichever Friday, whichever date that Friday is, the first weekend of February. So I still have some time to get that stacked up. I want to go over my 2021 goals real quick. Um, I have them written somewhere. So my top goals for 2021, I'm not sure if you can read this, but um, start, maintain, and finish the 52 week challenge, which I am so excited for. I've never done a challenge like that, like I've said, and it's going to be really cool to see that money stacking up Oh, I just cannot wait. Um, another goal is to put money into my savings account every month. So since I was doing really good on adding money into my savings account, but since I started putting money toward my car note, I have not been giving as much to my savings account, 
which is fine because I'm still saving. It's just not in my bank, if that makes sense. But I do want to start putting money into my savings account, even if it's like $25 a month. Just something to see that number go up because seeing the number goes up, going up is super motivating to me. Work on paying my car off, which I'm obviously doing already. I just want to keep it going. Maintain my side hustle, which is waiter. Um, waiter is like DoorDash or Uber Eats, but we don't... We have DoorDash here, but anyway, I think it's more of a Southern thing. Waiter is, I think. So, maintain my side hustle. That means don't slack off. Just keep it going because that's extra money every month. And it helps a lot. Um, and beef up my envelopes. I want juicy envelopes. <laughs> so, like these ones that have like $10, $20. Like, I want those to be like thick with two C's, okay? So, that's one of my goals. Because I, I mean, obviously, my... My sinking funds are kind of uh, wimpy right now, but one of my goals is to just work on saving, saving, saving up for stuff like that. So let me know what your goals are. Um, let me know if you have any questions, comments, or concerns. And I hope everyone has a great holiday if you celebrate Christmas. If not, I hope you have a great weekend. And let me know what your 2021 goals are. If you have a savings goal, let me know what that is. I need to do a video talking about like why I started this and what my goals are, like my long-term goals are, because honestly, I just need to do like an about me. Like if that's something you're interested in, if you don't care and you don't want to know about me, please let me know and I won't make the video, but I don't know. All right, I'm rambling. I have to go deliver with waiter today because I'm off work for my nine to five job and waiter is doing um minimum of ten dollar orders today meaning each order i'm gonna get paid a minimum of ten dollars since it's a holiday so you best believe i'm about to be out there trying to make as much money as possible so anyway y'all have a great holiday have a great weekend and i'll see y'all next week bye